now for this absolutely massive, bulky ATD DVD player. Yep, DVD player, which is just a tiny disc drive, and it has to have this absolutely massive, huge, bulky, thick case. And it doesn't have that many inputs, so I just know that it's just mostly empty. And I've got a 12-volt power supply hooked up to one of the backs because an IKEA lamp uses composite cables as a power supply for some reason. That's what it does when I hook it up. It doesn't do anything. <laughs> what, it turns off? It's starting to smoke up the back. What's that about? Is it supposed to do that? Keep going. No desk. Oh, it's just smoking up. It has enough function. Sticking the tongue out. Give me tray. Oh, it's took it back in. Oh, I just change it to coaxial. Why is it making that buzzing noise? Oh, I was trying to read the disc, that's what it was about. Oh, I can't open anymore. Put in the audio. Still working perfect. Is that all it does? It just smokes up? Fucking off! How cheap is this? Bend it like that. Plate, plate. A cheap. Just try and open it. It breaks. Want advanced hookups? How about doing anything? Put it back in a video. My video signal that way. Yeah, of course, it's just a huge empty box. Stupid piece of junk. Press it down so much more. Oh, it's making lights. What's that about? Oh, actually, you can't even see it. Whatever. No, don't unplug. Do my video signal. It's not very fun. I need one that's more than 12 volts. Oh no! True pet! Oh, whatever, that's it for ATD anyway. Oh wait, no it isn't. I need to turn the light back on. I'll just leave the advanced hookup in. See if it'll do anything. Stupid bulky empty metal box. Big hollow box. 